but in general both models the consulting model and the software solution model can make you money hello everybody here's Armin Rao again I help leaders in late stage entrepreneurs so say from eight to 20 employees to become better leaders changing founders into leaders that's my mission today's session is about which business model to choose if you are using technology to deliver your services now watch this video until the end so that you get some more input on the right business model if you would like to learn more about business models leadership for entrepreneurs get inspiration three times a week just click on the button below this video and subscribe to my channel also don't forget to switch on the bell so that you're always alerted about new contents on leadership for entrepreneurs now today's video is about a business model or finding the right business model especially if you are using technology to deliver your services now some six years ago actually ten years ago I got to know a company a, a startup that concentrated on innovation and uh, they as many technology startups really they started off with some consulting so they helped some companies some bigger companies some smaller companies to improve their innovation capacity now they also developed a tool to do that they concentrated on crowdsourcing which is to involve either your employees or even the market external people into your innovation process and they use this technology to do surveys to collect ideas and also to develop new innovative ideas now at a certain point they found out that actually with every project they also needed more people and they were not quite sure what they wanted to do did they want to actually sell the platform or the service now that is a very classical problem that startups have if you are at a certain point and you maybe have some 10 people doing a lot of consulting and at the other hand you have a very good platform that can help you with it I would actually recommend to analyze first of all what is your favorite approach do you define yourself more as a consultant company do you define yourself more as a software solutions or technology company or are you neutral to you don't care so much you just go for the one that maybe makes more money now you can actually make money with both the question here is how now if you go for the consulting model what you actually do you have to hire more people that go for um, uh, the 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 business just going to put this a little closer so I hope you can see this here on the flip chart and what you actually do you um, you hire more people with more projects and more customers now the trick is here to have a very strong method that you use all the time a standardized method for your consulting in this case for the innovation consulting and that you can teach your new hires and junior people in the application of this method and then what you do you actually build an organization that has the size or the, the form of a pyramid where you've got the senior consultants at the top of the pyramid you've got the consultants in the middle and the juniors at the bottom so there are various ways of how you can even have this in a more detailed way and you know what the juniors do they actually concentrate on very diligently and in a disciplined way to apply that method what the seniors here do they mainly concentrate on sales and the consultants on the project management that is more or less the consulting model what is the advantage of that how can you make more money first of all you've got a standardization through that through this method especially in the analysis or the fact finding the ff fact finding and the analysis part of 
um, the project and you can actually charge per day much much more than these juniors cost you. Then you've got the senior or partner who is responsible for the overall project who gives the quality uh, assurance and the project managers who make sure that the project is delivered on time. So if you can develop a lot of value with this, you can actually also make a lot of money. The second approach is, and you, sorry, and you use the technology as the basic here, the technology platform, your tool. The technology or software or product model is different. What you do here, you basically do the following. Your delivery looks a little bit like that. This is much better now because here you can actually see the bar and the bar represents a solution. And you don't use this solution anymore. The customer uses it. You don't do the consulting anymore and the project. The customer does the consulting projects with this whole solution. And the main part, the, 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 the major part actually of this solution is your platform. And that is what is standardized. And then there's a little part that is always customized, customized to the individual requirements of your customer. This is also a very nice model because here you can actually make, make money with licenses and a software as a service model, which will give you monthly fees uh, on your software. So instead of selling it, selling licenses, you actually rent your software and that gives you recurring uh, revenues, which is quite nice, whereas licenses is one off, uh, off revenues. The advantage is always there. You build this platform once and then you sell it several times. And that is what you call scalability. Now to summarize, if you have a service business or if you start offering solutions, complex solutions to the market and you are thinking about what the right business model is and you're using a technology, you can actually make money with both models, the service model or the software solution model. It just depends on what you prefer and what you would like to go for from a market potential point of view maybe, but in general, both models, the consulting model and the software solution model can make you money. Business models are very important to become a successful company and you have to be a leader in the strategic sense, you know, to find the right business model. The life program actually teaches you how to become a great company leader within weeks. So if you would like to learn more about leadership and get a free consulting session with me, click on the link underneath this video, apply for a session. We will talk about a specific problem. It's completely free of charge and I'm looking forward to having you. This was Armin Rao from A. Leonard Rao, the entrepreneur's entrepreneur. And don't forget, lead yourself.